The U.S. Naval Academy breaks new ground hosting the 2018 Congressional Medal of Honor Convention. WJZ is live. Pol political reporter Pat Warren has more on the significance of this event. Pat? Well, Mary, it's the first for a service organization, a service academy, the city of Annapolis and the state of Maryland. <laughs> The Naval Academy Band heralds the news of Congressional Medal of Honor Society's 2018 convention in Annapolis. The Congressional Medal of Honor is the highest military award for valor in combat. There are 71 living recipients, including Dakota Meyer, seen in this 60 Minutes report. And the State House in Annapolis this morning, Marylanders Barney Barnum and Brian Thacker among them, looking forward to this one of a kind experience with the Navy midshipmen. No one despises combat or war any more than those of us who have experienced it. But we have to be training young men and women, like on the yard, prepared to step up, do what needs to be done, because there are factions around this world that want to take us down. As a prelude to the September convention, the Medal of Honor recipients raised the society's flag on the State House lawn. In spite of all the things that have sought to divide us in this country, and that still divide us today, we are brought together by the tremendous respect that we hold and the incredible debt that we owe to all of those who have worn the flag of our nation on their arm and who are willing uh, to lay down their lives to protect the rights and the freedoms that we all hold so dear. The Congressional Medal of Honor was authorized by Congress and signed into legislation by President Abraham Lincoln in 1863. And there was a moment of silence in memory of the victims of the Las Vegas shooting. I'm Pat Warren reporting live. Now back to you. Pat, thank you so much. The 2018 Medal of Honor Society convention is September 12th through the 16th.